PLCS, unique products for gas distribution. The gas-free mechanical plastic T abandonment tool. To begin, first fasten the safety clamp to the underside of the T. The clamp ensures the T will be held securely on the main during the abandonment process. First remove the cap. Tighten on the plastic thread to valve adapter. Take care not to damage the plastic threads. Use the bar wrench to further tighten the adapter without over tightening. Next, install the ball valve. Hand tighten only. The O-ring creates the seal. Install the extension housing. Remove the PE cutter from the T by attaching the PE cutter removal adapter onto the T handle shaft and secure with the small set screw. Attach the assembly onto the extension housing. Make sure the ball valve is in the open position. Push down on the shaft so the hex end engages the recessed hex in the T cutter. Loosen and remove the cutter from the T. Withdraw the cutter to above the ball valve and close the ball valve. Bleed off the excess gas. Remove the assembly with the captured cutter. Now remove the hold down sleeve that remains inside at the base of the T using the extractor shaft. Again, attach the assembly onto the extension housing. Open the ball valve and push down until you feel the extractor enter into the sleeve. Maintain moderate downward force and turn the shaft counterclockwise until the sleeve is removed from the T. Once you feel the sleeve released from the T, withdraw the sleeve to above the ball valve, close the ball valve, and bleed off the excess gas. Remove the assembly with the captured sleeve. Remove the extension housing. Install the gas stopping plug into the main hole using the socket adapter by attaching the threaded plug onto the end of the shaft. 
tighten the assembly onto the ball valve. Attach the ratchet and socket to the hex on the shaft. Open the ball valve and push down on the shaft until you feel the plug bottoms out into the hole in the main. Maintain downward pressure while turning clockwise. Once the leading thread engages the pipe, turn the shaft clockwise for the recommended rotations according to main size to tighten the plug. For example, 4 inch SDR11 requires 7 revolutions. Plug tightening procedures are detailed in the instruction manual. As you're tightening, open the bleed valve to verify gas has stopped. If possible, open the service meter valve to ensure gas to the service has stopped as well. If necessary, further tighten the plug in quarter turn increments and verify the gas has stopped. Once gas has stopped, pull up on the shaft to disengage it from the plug. Withdraw the shaft to above the ball valve and close the ball valve. Bleed off the excess gas and remove the assembly. Install the sight glass onto the ball valve. Look through the sight glass to ensure the plug was installed correctly. If all looks good, remove the equipment and T. Then permanently abandon the service area according to company procedures. The operation is now complete.